In this video, I'll show you how to solve the problem where you get this message from your iPhone. This Apple ID has not yet been used in the iTunes store. So what should you do and how you need to bypass this message to be able to download the app you're looking to download on the App Store. So it's very easy. First thing you need to do is when you get this message, you need to press review. Do not press cancel. Press review. This error message is mostly because your Apple ID is not verified. And this is what we'll do right now. So once you're here, you need to select your country in this list. Okay, mine is already selected here. And you need to check this small toggle here. Agree to terms and condition. It needs to be green. Then once you've done this, press the next button. First here, they will ask if you want to input a payment method. If you don't want to put your credit card or PayPal account, just leave to none. You don't have to put one. Then under first name and second name, you just have to invent a name. It doesn't have to be yours. So I just put test. Now under billing address here, you'll have to fill it with uh, some information. You cannot leave this blank. So go ahead and fill it with your own address. Then here under phone, you need to input a phone number. Uh, it doesn't have to be yours again, but obviously it's better if you put um, your own one next. Then press continue. And now let's try to download the app again. Let's see if the error message comes again. So I, let's say I want Roblox, I'll tap get install it will ask to type your uh, password of your apple id so i'll go ahead and do this all right i'll press the sign in done and let's see you have not verified your apple id okay no problem tap the ok button now and it will send a verification email to your Apple ID uh, email you have associated with your account. If you didn't receive the email, just press resend verification email here and it will send a new one. So I have here on my other phone what the email should look like. Verify your Apple ID and you need to press this link over here. You see, verify now. Go ahead and do this. Okay, you should get this page. It didn't load properly, but no problem. Just go down. And here you need to enter the password of your Apple ID to verify this email. So I'll do this. Okay, then press the small arrow. And automatically on your other phone, or maybe you've done it on the computer, uh, you should get the message that uh, Apple ID sign in request with your email address and you need to press the allow button. You'll then uh, get a number here on your iPhone. And what you need to do is to go on your other iPhone or again, maybe you do this on a computer and type the number you see over here. You absolutely need to do this to verify. So I'll go ahead. And by the way, you'll receive another, another number. Don't copy mine. 763171. Then press continue here. And you'll get this message email address verified. Great. Go back over here, tap OK. And you'll tap done. Usually this should stop spinning at a point, but if yours is still spinning like this and you want to get done, just close the App Store and then press App Store again, open, and then download the app you want to get. Let's say this one, and you just have to do it again here. Enter your Apple ID password. Okay, sign in. And now it should download since the Apple ID is verified. Here we go. The download just started. So this is it. I will just show you with another app just to make sure. Just to make sure, let's say I want Pokemon Go. If I press get over here.
the app will start downloading too and you won't have this problem ever again. So I hope this tutorial was useful uh, for solving your problem. If so, please leave a like, comment down below if it worked for you and uh, subscribe and I will see you in the next one. Thanks a lot for watching.